these are people that came from the same people that were brought this time. Muhammad Ali is the one who got to revelation from Easy Gabriel. And we believe that is from God Almighty. So God Almighty is the one that knows best who his prophet is. And now if you put Islam to the side, if you go to the Christianity, the Christianity, did Jesus ever claim to be divine? Did he ever say, I am God? Perhaps he has, but more. Nowhere, nowhere he says that, by the way. Muhammad, he got his revelation by Angel Gabriel. Yeah, they have like eyewitnesses. No, no, he didn't, but for example, he contested with the Quran that came down. For example, if I said to a Christian, can you prove to me that Jesus done miracles? You can't. But if, the, if an atheist comes to me and says, can you prove to me that Islam is the truth? I'll say, sure. I have the evidence here, which is the Quran, we can, we can test it. We have a physical thing that we can test. So the Quran is the miracle that the Prophet Muhammad came with. And not only that, the Bible says what? You should know the true prophets and from the false prophets by their prophecies. No, their fruits, yeah. Yeah? by their fruits. By their fruits is what we have yeah. to Thank you very much for your opinion. So the point is what? We say the Quran, if it is from God Almighty, what does Satan want? Let's suppose this is from Satan. What does Satan want? Satan wants you to do evil. Satan wants you to worship other gods. Yes or no? I mean, Satan is all about deceiving you. Man. Good. Deceiving in what way? What's the do you think I can uh, intervene so I can help her? Uh, what? Drink alcohol? No. To commit sex outside support. marriage? No. To murder? Yeah. No. Because he's saying a lot of things and she's not like, no. like no. able to. Worship other gods besides God Almighty. I'll say Almighty. everything back. I follow no. the whole script. Yeah, they do, and they, she's she's good, but the thing is, she doesn't know how to handle it. That's the thing. So they like to do that. That's why they put so many cameras there. Satan wants people to worship other gods, different gods. Yeah? So now, can you tell her it's uh, it's okay if I can intervene? Yeah? So she doesn't mind. Does that make sense to you that there are three gods, but they are one? Okay. I don't think there's three gods. Okay, good. So. Okay, would you okay, would you say Jesus is God? I think that, like, Jesus, yeah, Jesus is like God revealed in the flesh. Okay, so it's still God, but he's just God. Okay. So do you accept that God has some attributes? For example, would you accept that God is the all the all truth? Good. Can God lie? He can, but he wouldn't do it. Okay. We say like, okay, good. Oh hold on, but can God lie? Yeah, can God lie? I don't know, that's all. Okay. He so can do I, anything. Can he, can he die? Can he cease to exist? Yeah, he, he can't cease to exist. Good. So there are things that doesn't befit his majesty. This doesn't limit God. What it means is that God cannot lie because truth comes from God. God cannot die. Now, when we say, when the Christians come and tell us God can be a man, now you are dealing with a few other attributes. If you said God can lie, you're dealing with one attribute that you're associated to God that doesn't belong to him. When you say he became a man, you're saying the following now. God is weak. God is ignorant, God had to eat food, God relied on other things. So, Can God choose to become not, a man? That's not. the question. So, he can choose, right? Okay, if good. he wants to. Alright, can he do anything? Okay, good. Can he die? Okay, so the thing is, I think when Jesus died, he didn't He didn't die in, in spirit. He was never disappeared. Exactly. Like, imagine Jesus still exists to this day. That's right. Like he, would, he still exists, but he's not here with us. Okay, he, good. His body is not here. So, let's talk about who God is. Can God cease to exist? No. Okay, good. But well, you said he can do anything. Well, if I said, why are you limiting God? That's my point. Can God lie? No, because he's the truthful. Then can I say, well, why are you limiting God? The point I'm saying is this, my sister. When we say God can do anything, what does that mean? Like if I said, can God, forgive me for saying this, can God become a shoe? No, because it goes against his majesty. What we say is the following. That's why when, when the Christians say God became a man, you are now automatically saying he was weak. He was ignorant. When Jesus went to the fig tree and he realized it's not the season for the fig. What? <laughs> no, but he's fully God What's and fully thing? man. Okay. How so he's not weak. Can you be can you have a full triangle square? Can you have what? A triangle square. How many can sides is a square? A triangle square. Yeah. Fully triangle, fully question. square. Okay. Can we can have he be, can he be a fly? Can you okay. Okay. ask okay. him in the how Quran, many, does it say the many, God is like nothing else in this world or anywhere? How many sides does a square have? Okay, how many sides does a triangle have? Okay, I believe there's a triangle square. Okay. Does that exist? Can it exist? I don't think so. It's an impossibility, thank you. So, if a triangle square can't exist, you cannot come and say, God is fully man and fully God. How could you? I'm fully chicken and fully human. I'm fully tree and fully man. Because he's God. It's, look. He's not limited Once, okay. by what we are limited, okay. by our can, math okay. can, and by our okay. physicality. Can God lie? 
God is Can God lie? Okay, God is truthful. Can God lie? Listen. Can God lie? Simple question. Okay. He does not lie. Why that's are you limiting God? Because that's his nature. He said oh, that he's truthful. Okay, one second. Okay. So his nature is what? He is truthful and he that's doesn't right. lie. Yeah. But then they come and say, but he can be a man. Now when you become a man, you become weak and ignorant. No, that's your definition. Where does God say okay. that if God becomes a man, okay. he's weak and, uh, okay. and uh, vulnerable? Simple no. Question. Is Jesus, is God all powerful? Yes. Okay. Can you stop is, is, is a man, me as a man, am I all powerful? Stop interjecting. You're not God. I know I'm not. That's Don't my interject. Thing. Am I all stop interjecting. You, you, I'm weak. Stop. So look, God is all powerful. Speak I am to me. weak. Is God is all knowing, correct? Can you stop interjecting? Okay. Am I all knowing? No. Good. So no. 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 So the point is this, yeah? My dear sister, what I'm saying is that when we say, like, he says, God to do anything, can God lie? No. Why are you changing your mind? Why? Because what he's saying is correct. Yeah, first time in his life. Yeah, it's correct. Why? Because God cannot lie. But then when you say God became a man, you are now attacking a couple of attributes, which is what? He's become weak. He's become ignorant. When That's Jesus your definition asked, of that. Okay, when Jesus was asked, when is the hour? What did he say? Only God, the Father knows the hour. Before he's the Father. Who's the Father? Jesus. He's the Son. Oh, so he's not the Father. Of course not. Oh, so, okay, one second. So is the Son God? Yes. Is the Father God? Yes. But the Father's not the Son? No. And the Son is not the Father? No. <laughs> Very confusing. My dear sister, look, in a nutshell, I'm not here to mock anybody, yeah? I'm, 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 I'm genuinely, I'm not here to mock anybody. I'm genuinely trying to make well, something look, look. If you read the Quran, sister, Islam says something very simple. And I, look, one day you're going to be a mother, you're going to have kids. You're not married now, yeah? Change somebody okay. to Christian. Imagine this, sister, yeah? What was your name, sister? Please. Cindy. Your Cindy. Cindy. Sister Cindy. I understand. I'm going to ask you a question. Imagine you have kids. Girl, you change their nappy, you give birth to them, you look after uh, them, you nourish them, you protect them. They've come to an age 18 so years old. Else. And you know what they say to you? you? Know. They say, Mom, you, you did nothing for me. I'm going to go on Frank Alley. Okay. How would you feel? Look at your face. Look at your facial expression. How would you feel? You just turned over here. This guy's bothering me. Ungrateful, sad. Yes? Would you be happy with your children? I still love them. True, but would you be happy with them that they have left you now and they are thanking me? I'm a nobody, I've done nothing for them. Would you be happy? Would you say they are grateful children, they are good children? I don't think if I wish my children they'll be like that. But... Okay, good. And this is why God doesn't want his creation to be like how? Let me tell you. Because God Almighty has given you life, He sustains you, He looks after you, He provides for you, He's given you everything, and then you go and do what? Where is he gone? Alhamdulillah, Rabbil Alameen. Is he here? I'm he? here. I would have been left. <laughs> I didn't see him. So, so the thing is this. You do what? You give credit to who? Jesus. And what does Jesus say in the Bible? He says, on that day, many will come to me and say, Lord, Lord, did we not prophesy in thy name? And in thy name cast out demons. Who cast out demons in the name of Jesus? Listen to Christians. Okay, you know what Jesus will say? Get away from me, I never knew you. Okay, let so me explain that. One second, one second, one second, one second. The point is this. Christians are the ones that prophesy in his name and cast out demons in his name. Jesus is saying, get away from me, I never no, knew you. No, no. The question is the following. Ali, Ali, listen. My dear sister, what, 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 my dear sister Cindy, who do you think deserves worship? God Almighty who created everyone or a human being? There were people who were t taking Jesus' you know, name to cast out demons. The they were not the followers. Right I'm, I'm the helping church. her. I'm helping her. Why are you after no, women? Why can't you pray as a man? Are you just here for women? Listen, just because your scripture says you should be quiet in the church. No, just because your scripture says that, uh, oh, you know, rule over women doesn't mean that you can only talk to women. Listen, there were there were there were people in the days of Jesus who were not followers of Jesus. They were casting out demons in His name. Okay, but I'm Okay, those are the people that says many will come and say we cast out demons in your name, but you never knew me. That's what he was talking about. So he doesn't know that. I know so, that. I know what's You don't know that. I know okay. She, the sister, it's okay. I'm here to help her. Okay. Because look, you are, you're a bay, man. Okay. You've been doing this for years. She's just a lady that just Why came into the park. Like I'm trying to bloody break Okay, I'm here to help her. That's fine. Why are you afraid of me? Cindy, Cindy, don't be afraid. Don't be afraid. Listen, I know you're a chicken. I know you're a chicken. It's okay. I know you are. I'm definitely not fully chicken. Yeah, you are a chicken. It's okay. Okay, Do you think we should give the credit of everything, the blessing of our life to God? Or a false god. False god? Who's a false god? There's no false. Okay, we don't give anything to a false god. We don't have a false god. We don't need to thank this. We need to give real Thank you, sister. So what I'm saying is this: the one true god has to be one. He cannot have partners. Anyone? Can you have two managers, two bosses? Ask him why Allah says we. If he's one. And somebody turns left. How could you have? There's only one true god. No, you don't have one true god. It's a royal majestic sense. No, 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 no,
that we that he's using. Wait a minute, it's Ahad and Wahad. Wahad. No, no, no. You, you. No, no, no. Why are you trying to harass her? No, no, no. no. Look. No, Quran says Allah is Ahad. Ahad means one off. Okay, it doesn't say Wahad. Okay, Wahad means one. This is what he's not telling you. Ahad means one off. The, uh, is Allah is one of Allah, right? So uh, Ahad, ask him if Ahad is one off, then why is he saying that Allah is one? When Allah is saying I'm one off, so Allah is saying one off and he's saying one. The fact that he's doing this, you know why? Anytime there's someone on the verge of accepting Islam, they are Muslim. Are you on the verge of it? Are you on the verge of it? Is she on the verge of it? So don't make stuff up, man. She's not. She's not. I'm just here because I see her that she's new to the park, and you are here for every every week, and I'm just helping her out. Why are you afraid of me? Don't be afraid. I said you are a chicken. You can only talk to women. You can't face a man. I know you're a chicken. No, no, no. Your your god is a false god. It's a moon god. Why you have the crescent moon on your mosque? Tell it. Ask him why he has the crescent moon on the mosque. If that's a symbol of the Quraysh god, Hubal. They worship Hubal. They don't know that. That's the the their, their god. That's what it is. So you have a false god. Why do you worship Hubal? But this is just a simple question. Let's make it basic, yeah? Put Islam, Christianity, all the religions aside. If you woke up one day, would you believe God is one or God is three? One. If you wanted the relation with God, you start thinking I personally would believe God is one, but who am I to say that there's only one God? Well, let me yeah. tell you something, sister. What if there's a thousand Let, let me tell you something, sister, thank you. Do you know why you said God is one? Because in Islam, we believe in something called the fitrah. That's why we say every child is born a Muslim. You know why? Because you do not need any religion to believe that God is one. I asked you, I said, put all religions to a side, okay? And if you was to just wake up one day and say, hmm, a higher power exists, you will never, ever think there are religion. tribes that don't have never. one God. They were born without a religion and they have multiple I'm gods. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so he's just making no, stuff no, up. Check this out, okay. no, I'm, stop I'm, making I'm, stuff up, man. No, sister, I'm, too, I'm calling you to worship one God. He's saying, no, 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 there's multiple. It's like a prophet. No, I said there's one God. The it's Bible says there's one God. It's the Father God. Father is God. Father, some God. Yes. The Holy Spirit God. That's right. They are distinct but not separate. They are one essence. That is the way it is. Okay? That is the way it is. Okay? It's distinct but not separate. They are not three separate gods. It's one God. Okay? That's the attribute. That's... that's don't touch me. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Shouting, oh, like, it's got, it's got Najis, but we need to listen, bro. Najis, say the Khanzir, Najis, 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 he said Najis. Najis, you are Najis, he's Najis. Khanzir, Khanzir. You are Khanzir and Najis. You are Khanzir and Najis. Let's read what it says, yeah? It says, look, you open it randomly, yeah? It says, woe that day to the deniers. Oh disbelievers, eat and enjoy yourselves a little. Indeed, you are criminals. What do you do with it? Where does it say Nasara? Where does it say people of the book? Why are you lying? Does it say people of the book? Where does it say to them? Bow down, they do not bow. Woe that day to the deniers. Does it say Nasara? Does it say Nasara? To the people of the Does it say Nasara? What does it say? My dear sister, on the, on the Day of Judgment, it's a warning to the disbelievers. You know why? Who's the disbelievers? No, there's no, there's no Nasara. There's no Nasara here. My it says, sister. Quran says the, the, the Jews, the Christians, and the and the star worshipping the Sabians have nothing to worry about. Why don't you tell her about that? That's your fitness. You're a kafir. 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 Khanzir, Khanzir, Kafir. Tell him to stop. Tell him to stop. Tell him to back up. Do you have any questions? Okay. Is it parable? Do you have any questions about Islam, etc. you would like to ask me? No, tell him why is the crescent moon up there. Ask him why is the crescent moon on your mosque. Ask him why. No, 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 no. Ask him, ask him. All of us, Alhamdulillah. Any of you guys worship him? No. Are you sure? I do not worship him. I have a question. Can I ask you a question about Islam? Oh, you just want to talk to the lady. And like you believe, sister, God is one, and that's what you believe in turn me and Yeah. I hope God Almighty guides you. And the shayateen like this will come and Yeah, you're the shayateen. You don't. You couldn't work. Didn't work. Sorry. Dawah is a failure. Islam is the. Everybody's leaving. Islam because of what you're doing. You're doing a, a lot of people. Ex Muslims all over the world. Ex Muslims all over the world. Ex Muslims are. Uh, it's a revolving door. People are leaving Islam every day. Who follows Jesus? Who follows Jesus? My wife is coming up like Jesus' mother. I pray like Jesus. 
I would circumcise like Jesus. I stay away from Pope like Jesus. Ask me, do you Pope? Yes. Yes. Yeah, exactly. So my point is this: we follow Jesus more. Do you eat camel? Do you eat camel? Yes. Okay, they camel. Camel is in the same words where it says. Do not eat pork in the Bible. It says, "Don't eat camel." The when they eat camel, they have to do their wudu again because that makes them dirty. So it? camel is haram, but they eat it. That's what you you, you don't know that. I know that because he's going to not tell you that. You're a liar. You try to come here and give false dawah to Christians. What about camel? Do you eat camel? Camel is haram because you had your wudu is broken. Why is your wudu broken? Okay, your wudu is broken. Did you do wudu again? Okay, so wudu is broken. Wudu is broken. If you eat, uh, if you eat camel, your wudu is broken. Okay. Allah told they can eat pork in the desert. Yeah. Allah told they can eat pork in the desert. Stop! Stop harassing Christians. Stop harassing new Christians. Stop harassing uh, Christians. When you are in the desert, nothing. Stop harassing them. If you are big, you can eat the fruit. That is the Allah. All right. That is the Allah. So, well, Mr. Ali Dawa was thinking. He can Otherwise, just persuade a Christian lady with his false uh, doctrine and with his false claims about Christianity. When a Christian man comes, he runs. Just run away, Dawa. Just run away. That's all what you guys can do. These guys, they come over here, try to find women. That's it. That's all this is. These people are just here to harass Christians and we are not going to stand for it. We can come and tell them what Islam really is. A lot of people don't know, so they just come over here and do that. Jesus is Lord, Islam is from the pits of hell. The way, truth and the life.